Hey, welcome to my channel, Cooking with Manual Focus, and today we're going to be making some absolutely delicious air fried baby back ribs. So fam, here's the game plan. So I got a slab of baby back ribs. So I want to get these bad boys as close as a smoky, you know what I'm saying, barbecue baby back rib as I can. So what we're going to go, we're going to go with some liquid smoke. Then we're going to hit it with some barbecue rub, right? All right, fam, here we go. Here's our baby back ribs that we're going to be using a whole rack. We're going to throw those in the air fryer for these air fried baby back ribs. So what we're going to do is we're going to turn this baby back rib on his back and then we are gonna get underneath that membrane because we are gonna remove that membrane for this recipe so once we get underneath it we let the knife do a little twist and then it's gonna lift up on that membrane just like that and fam all you got to do you can take a paper towel or you can use just your bare hands but what I'm gonna do today I'm just gonna take that paper towel and then we gonna you know pull it we're gonna pull this membrane back just like that. And then fam, you in the game. All right fam, before we put this in the air fryer, I'm gonna look at my rack and see just how you know much I can put on the rack. So I can go pretty much half and half for you know, a slab of ribs for my air fryer. Now for your air fryer, it may be a little bit, you know, less or more, depending on your model, you know, go with what you need to, but for me, you can see right here, my grate is going to fit half of this, so I'm going to cut it in half, and then I'm going to use two racks, and we're going to get this bad boy prepared for that air fryer. So now we just take these ribs, as you can see here, when you place it on his back, you can see exactly where those bones lie, and then we just cut these ribs in half, just like that, and that's pretty much all that we're going to do to these ribs, other than taking off this little hanging meat here. Now, that's all I'm gonna do to these ribs because they look pretty decent. Other than that, hey fam, we in the game, so we gonna go ahead and get this seasoned. We gonna use that liquid smoke as a binder, then we gonna go with that barbecue rub, and then I'm gonna place it in the air fryer. So I'm gonna go in with a little bit of that liquid smoke because I want my ribs to taste like they come straight off that smoker, right? So just a little bit of liquid smoke for that binder. You can use W sauce if you like, but again, for this recipe, I'm gonna use this liquid smoke. It's gonna give us a little bit of that smoky, smoky flavor. So we'll get this all coated, even the size, right? In that liquid smoke, fam. Then after it's coated, I'm gonna go in with this Killer Hogs barbecue rub. Now, fam, I'm going in with two rubs for this recipe. Go with what you know, go with what your palate likes. But for me, I'm gonna hit it with that Killer Hogs. It's gonna give me a little bit of color, right? And then I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna hit it with that Pit Balls Hickory Bacon Blend. And these two combinations of rubs, I'm gonna tell you they're absolutely fantastic. Now, I'm gonna use this like as a light sprinkling of this rub here. And I'm not going to go heavy handed. So the first rub, I'm going to go a little bit liberal. Then the second rub is just going to, you know, complement those flavors. Now we're going to turn these bad boys over. And it's smelling absolutely delicious from that liquid smoke. Because I'm used to that smoky flavor. And then, like I said, we're going back in. Like we did on that back side. That liquid smoke first. Give a nice little smoky flavor and then we going in with that killer hogs to give it a little bit of that color that we're looking for and fam i'm gonna tell you these are gonna be some absolutely delicious air fried ribs in the air fryer mm. so these air fried ribs fam are gonna get you in the game so they're gonna be quick you know you're not gonna be in the heat or whatever because i know it's absolutely hot outside and fam, you ain't got to worry about it, man. You can stay in the house and come from your own home and have some delicious ribs whenever you want it, have you want it, in the air fryer. So we got these bad boys seasoned up as we want them. We're going to go 390 degrees in the air fryer. So we're going to preheat the air fryer 390 degrees. I'm 
I'm gonna go meat side up first so I can get like a bark on this baby back rib. You wanna make sure that you compact your ribs because as you cut them, they are gonna come out nice, tender, juicy with your meat in one compact area. It's gonna give you a nice, fantastic bite. All right, fam, we got the air fryers preheated, it's ready to go. So we are gonna put these racks in. And like I said, we are gonna cook these bone side down. And I want to keep these kind of low because I don't want to like crisp the top. And so I'm gonna put one rack, you know, right underneath, just like so. And then we're gonna close this bad boy. We're going 390 degrees, like I said, for 20 minutes. And then in between time, about 10 minutes in, we're gonna switch those racks so we get even cooking. All right, fam, so we're 10 minutes into the cook. So what I wanna do is I want to, you know, take these racks and I wanna rotate them. As you can see right here, I don't want one rack to be overly done and one rack not to be done just because we got a tiered racking system on this air fryer. So we'll get these out. You can see here, the first set of ribs, doing good this set is doing well but we won't even cooking so we're gonna just move these racks and then we're gonna go for the remainder of the 20 minutes so 20 minutes total for the first session of the cook so fam we got 10 minutes to go before we go into the next step of this recipe so continue to watch and we'll see you guys in a little bit all right fam we are done 20 minutes let's look at these ribs and see how they coming along. I'm telling you, man, my house smells absolutely fantastic, fam. But look at this right here. Hey, they look pretty good. Look like they got a nice little bark. Now, we gonna take these ribs and we gonna wrap these bad boys. So we gonna get them prepared to go back in for additional 20 minutes so we can get them tender and keep them juicy, fam. So hang on, hang tight with me. And we're gonna get them prepared. Here's that second rack coming out that we flip. And look at that, man. That looks absolutely amazing. Now, the cracking, I'm not really worried about. Do is we're gonna take a couple sticks of butter and we're gonna put this in to the aluminum foil. So, this is about two tablespoons or whatnot of butter per rib, right? So, you got about like four, you know, quarter inch slices of butter and next what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit it with about a tablespoon of light brown sugar just like so I'm gonna drizzle in a little bit of honey to keep that smoky profile I'm going in with that sweet baby ray sweet and smoky so we're gonna hit that with a little bit of that barbecue sauce like so and then we're gonna take our fine looking rack of rib right here and we're gonna place it meat side down just like so and what we want to do is we want to create just a full a little boat for it like so And fam, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit it with a little bit of apple juice inside this boat. Just like so. And we're gonna wrap this. I'm not gonna wrap it like all the way. I want some of it to be exposed so it's not like overly tenderizing these ribs, but these gonna be tender. So we're gonna use a full boat method on this cook right here. Now, fam, we got the first 20 minutes in. You've seen those ribs. They look absolutely delicious, fam. Now, we got to make sure that these ribs are tender, right? You want a tender, juicy baby back rib. You don't want nothing in the air fryer. You know what I'm saying? It could dry it out. You don't want no dry ribs, man. We want some tender ribs. 10 minutes in, we're going to switch those racks again for even cooking. All right, fam, so we're 10 minutes in. All we want to do right now, we don't have to look at anything. We just want to get these racks rotated again. 
just so we have even cooking and like i said fam they are smelling absolutely delicious man and fam we got these racks already situated and then we're gonna go the rest of the 10 minutes and then we'll see you guys and we're gonna get these bad boys sauced up all right fam we're done well technically not done but hey they're done for their cook so we're gonna get these ribs out just like so look at that right there fam that looks and smells absolutely amazing so what we want to do is we want to get these ribs outside of this full and we're gonna get them sauced up now we don't cook these ribs for a total of 40 minutes so fam be careful because this is gonna be a little bit on the hot side as you can probably see that steam coming off of those ribs but look at that right there looks absolutely amazing on the back side and let's get these turned over so i'm gonna remove this and you can see the bend test right there they ready because they almost breaking so you already know that they tender so we'll get these bad boys flipped Yes, sir. Look at that. Because we're going to sauce these ribs. So we're going to get some barbecue sauce on them. And we're going to bob. And we're going to bob Ross these ribs. We're going to get them looking good, fam. Yes, sir. They smell absolutely delicious. Got my mouth water. Hey, we're going to place them back in the air fryer. For about five minutes let that sauce tack up but look at that right there doesn't that look absolutely amazing all right fam we got that second rack sauced up so we're gonna move these over to that air fryer we're gonna get this put in like so and then we're going back in 390 so we got these bad boys sauced up they're going back in the air fryer for five minutes and we're gonna bring them back out after they sauce let them rest and then we're gonna cut into them about five minutes until that sauce tacks up we'll see you guys in a little bit all right fam we are ready to see these air fried ribs so let's check on these ribs right here as i take them out fam they smell delicious you've seen them but look at this right here Ooh -wee. nice and saucy we're gonna let these bad boys rest. I'm gonna get them on the cutting board so we can get these bad boys sliced. But look at the second rack coming out. Yes, sir. So I'm gonna get these off of this rack and I'm gonna let them rest. And then we're gonna cut into these nice air fried baby back ribs in the air fryer fam look at that yes sir so fam we're gonna let these rest a little bit for a couple minutes and then we're gonna cut into them and see how they turn out all right fam here we go we got these ribs they have finally rested hey it's the fourth of july so if you guys hear some popping in the background no it's not a shootout but is people going absolutely crazy out there with those fireworks but let's get these bad boys cut and see how they look but i can go ahead and tell you man these bad boys are juicy just how they're slicing from that first slice hey we in the game fam all right let me bring one up to you and let's look at the juiciness on it. Yes, sir. Ooh, we still nice and juicy. Yes, sir. Look at that. Now, that's what you want right there. You want a nice, juicy baby back rib. Hey, you in the game. All right, fam. There you have it. You got your absolutely delicious air fried baby back ribs. Nice, juicy. And you already know, we got to get this bad boy taste test. So, hey. Cheers, fam, and let's see how you mm. 
Hey, that's good. That is good, man. Mmm. Hey. Nice clean bite. Hey, you already know. It's cooked right. And it's juicy. Woo Look at that right there. Hey, that's absolutely amazing. And that flavor on this. Mm. Delicious, man. Mm, mm, mm. Now, if you're new to the channel and you like this content, go ahead and smash that like button and don't forget to smash that subscribe button. Now, turn on that bell so you know when I release my content. By the way, I do release most of my content Sundays at 2 p.m. We go on a premiere and um, hit me in the comments, man. I hit you back most definitely. And for the Focus family that's been rolling me for a while, you already know what I got to do. And I got to smash into these air fried baby back ribs. And we'll see you guys on the next recipe. I'm about to roll out. Peace.